Here we go again. A while back in the official Marvel's Avengers Discord, some stranger started relentlessly tagging me with racially charged comments, a nuisance more than anything. I asked them publicly to stop, even going so far as showing a moderator who promptly told me just to block him because he sure as hell wasn't going to do anything about it. Cool. So, as someone who regularly jumped into the Discord to communicate my frustrations and even share suggestions directly to developers, I decided to just stop going into the Discord. Skip to yesterday and someone tells me someone's in there with my name and I go in to find that it's true. But get this, when I engage them, they change their name and it's the same guy the official Marvel Avengers Discord is protecting. Honestly. I'm too big a boy to personally be surprised with a country where the ex-president couldn't denounce white supremacy, but for so poorly performing a game to flex inclusion and acceptance when this is what people have to expect in the official Marvel Avengers Discord, it's deplorable. As a black man who wouldn't even be involved if I wasn't outraged at how poorly this IP has been handled. I just don't want this happening to other people, unfortunately. I've reached a point where I can just take it, but you deserve better than this game. You deserve better than a community of people who define their identity, their very existence on how this game is publicly perceived. You can like the game just fine with all of its flaws and all of its problems, but how in God's name do you lack self-respect and self-awareness enough to try to force that onto other people? I implore you, listener, give these defenders a wide berth, which is to say, avoid interaction. Do not engage. If you have an opinion, complaint, or suggestion, submit it and avoid direct eye contact because the only confusion surrounding some of these helmet-needing illiterate apologists is how they can type so legibly by banging their heads on the keyboard. For levity's sake, I jumped into Photoshop to create some digital art based on a developer's joke. We're gonna make Soon into a nameplate also, I think. We're gonna make Soon into a nameplate also, I think. I posted it on the subreddit and it got removed, like my posts usually do, but not before getting over a thousand upvotes and provoking people to pay for 16 awards. You know the moderators love to slurp the devs and the companies that they represent, so there's no surprise that this was removed, but you know what's funny? Is that they still felt the need to remove it after all of the attention that it received, almost tripled the upvotes of the people actually playing the game at certain times on PC. So, I won't bore you with an explanation of how the Streisand effect works, but I have posted the individual nameplates on my Twitter in case anyone wants to use them online. It'd be too funny if this fart of a meme could have just died, but instead, <laughs> it'll live through the game's life because some company-loving shill of a moderator with a Doctor Who reference for a username was so triggered that they needed to remove the offensive images. And in case you're curious about how much of a no-fun zone the Reddit community is thanks to these mods, allow me to read the reasons that the post was removed. My dude. Your submission has been removed because it is considered low-effort content. Low-effort content may include costume-begging posts, nope. Meta commentary, can't talk about the game. Short jokes, joke needs to be longer, okay? You know, in the TikTok generation, your joke needs to be longer. Photoshops of logos, what? Oh, that's that's not okay, I'm, I'm, so, I'm so sorry. Memes, this is a no fun zone, buddy. You better not be bringing those memes in here. LFG posts, I'm, I'm looking for a group, I don't even wanna play this game. Account technical support questions, copycat posts. Moderators may remove any post at their discretion. We have the right to review service to anybody. Like I'm not wearing a mask in here, please. I'm wearing a hazmat suit, can you imagine?
Good luck growing an actual community with exclusively photo mode posts. Imagine not being paid and doing damage control for a company. If cuck is life for you, I'm not kink shaming, but what happened to dignity? What happened to self-respect? This video brought to you by the Self-Respect Gang. I have a gaming channel in my Discord if you ever feel like saying something that isn't exclusively praise for corporate overlords. If not, I appreciate you joining me in the glow of this ever-raging dumpster fire. Black Panther, Doctor Strange, Scarlet Witch, Vision, Ant-Man, Wasp, Captain Marvel, She-Hulk, War Machine, nope, Kate, Bishop, when? Soon. You see, the problem is, if you wanted to make a Young Avengers game, you should have done that. But you knew you wouldn't be able to sell it if you put that on the box. Do you think making stories with young, teenage girls makes you any less old as you wither and age? You people are the definition of out of touch, and what real people want is a mystery to you, because comedically, even though we share the same internet, the circles that you've cultivated are such echo chambers that you deliberately blind yourself to reality, which on a project that needs to actually make money to succeed, makes you poison. So the consensus with this game among players is, who cares? How can people be excited when you're deliberately designing characters people know and love and have for 80 years to be these ugly, knockoff versions because the designers are insecure so they force girls to cover up way up but only the girls because to them a leotard is sexist and also they're threatened by women with large breasts as if they aren't just as beautiful and worthy of inclusion as anybody else this is my dia and if I could mold her from clay or sculpt her from marble, I wouldn't make her any other way. Her Twitch link is in the description. You ever think about how poorly they'll implement some of these heroes? Like, we probably won't get an Ant-Man that can grow much larger than Kamala Khan. How much does that suck? If they were smart, They'd have him be Kamala in big in size indoors and huge outdoors, but you already know with this game. I think the days of hoping are behind us. Isn't that sad to say? Imagine if this game had a huge patrol area like Destiny did six years ago in 2014. Imagine if instead of riding on sparrows like the Guardians do, we all had personal means of quick traversal for the heroes that couldn't fly, of course. Black Widow could have a drone that she hangs from as it flies, Captain America could have his motorcycle, and because this is the Marvel Universe, and PIM technology has already been established that can shrink and grow things, grow it when you need it, shrink it when you don't, just like every man's favorite part of his anatomy. Unless you're a moderator on the Marvel's Avengers subreddit, in which case you have my full support and encouragement during your transition process. Do you like this track? Do you think it slaps? It's from Genshin Impact, the free game you've probably been hearing a lot about. It works, it's fun, it's free, which makes it three times as good as this game could have been if Marvel's Avengers launched in a state at least comparable to a bucket of poop. I share with you now a clip of the only developer who wanted a good game with more than two villains and characters that actually looked good like their MCU and comic book counterparts. Throw you off the bridge. One of their <laughs> Until next time, don't forget, it's funny to the developers that people still care enough about updates to ask. We're gonna make soon into a nameplate also, I think. Thanks, Phil. Really appreciate it. To each and every one of you watching, I love you. I mean, like, really love you. Don't bonk. It's natural. Thank you for watching, liking, and I encourage you to give me a piece of your mind in the comment section after. Okay? It's not just enough that you were in the stream chat for the premiere. Thank you, though. But, you know, comment. Beach. Stay perky when life wants you saggy. I'm Kyle, and I could have been your daddy. I'm ending videos like that now, by the way. Yeah.
glad we could work together on this all. My eyes are up here. Are you for real? We don't I am being objectified by this by this woman. We believe it's because I'm a man. She doesn't regard me as relevant enough to look into my face holes. In the ocular cavity? This is absurd. I will not just be looked at like a piece of meat. Just because I'm not wearing a shirt. Ugh. Oh. They're going to tell me it's because of what I'm wearing, Dia. Dia. <laughs> it's because of what I'm wearing. Oh my god. And she's purple. 